Now next one, we are supplying some dynamic width using a scanner function with the help of integer types of variables using keyboard. First of all, we are declaring some variable as width. There are local variable has created called as width along with two bytes because type of width is integer. Initial value is garbage. Next one, enter width. Let's see, we are not able to justify what is the current width based on source code. Means current program can the source code ke basis for batana possibly means current program can the currently value kidney width may display displayed value is 256. How many bits are required? Agar aap is program ko 10 time execute ho, 10 time 10 different different times different ten, different different width value pass karna possibly using a scanner function therefore behavior of this program is dynamic with respect to width then next one ports enter width as we are discussing during output function ports or put as it is used to displaying only single string or single line what is the difference between displaying any string using printf or using ports? In case of ports, we don't have any need to specifying extra lesson because after displaying message, it will change the line automatically. Enter width. Then put the SK case my line automatically change over next one is scanf function scanf ke through data read kya suppose that we are supplying width value as 5 using keyboard we are entering width value as 5 then cursor will be after pressing enter key cursor will be available on the next line the value of width becomes 5 then in that that place in case of next printf value of width is 5 therefore a star is replaced by logically 5 it will becomes like a percent percent 5d then displayed number is 256 her value is displayed as 256 in the form of 5 bits like that therefore here two spaces are filled before displaying this value this is the output in that case Suppose if we are executing again same application second time, we are able to entering another bit value, maybe 10, 12, anything. Therefore, in that case, bit is considered a dynamic bit.